high school seniors and current college students for part six of completing the FAFSA. I highly encourage you to make sure that you specify the colleges you plan to attend or currently attend so that that college can receive your financial aid information from your FAFSA. Colleges that don't receive it aren't going to be able to calculate your financial aid without it. And once you submit that information to them, expect the college will complete a calculation of what they believe your financial aid is, and they will issue you a financial aid award letter. Uh, I highly encourage you to check your emails and your physical mail because they could come in either form or fashion. When colleges send you a financial aid award letter, review it, reach back out if something doesn't look right, and ask questions. Also know, you can appeal a financial aid award letter if your financial situation has changed between the time you've completed the FAFSA and the time you received the letter. Follow me for more tips and for part seven.